Oh, I feel like you rigged that. They're trick pins. I'm gonna do that again. Okay. Now we're getting serious. Okay. <clears throat> yeah, yeah, okay, that's right. Second time, second time's turn. Okay, cool. I'm going to now apply lipstick without uh, using my hands. Okay. And I'm just gonna put it in the crook of my elbow. Remember in Breakfast Club, when she puts it down her bra and does it that way? I'm not that cool, so I'm just gonna do it this way. Okay. There we go. I think I got that left peak. Right peak. Oh God, I should have stretched first. Okay, here we go. Just kind of motion oh, around generally. How'd I do? Pretty good? Okay, yeah. great. Oh, now I gotta see. <laughs> Thank you. I think it's windier. I think we should do more. Okay. Do I look heroic? Fantastic. Let's see what number one is. Number one. Okay, it kind of, it's fruitier than I imagined something tasting. Okay, I don't have a guess yet. The martini glass full of alternative milk is, um, that's oat. Okay, it's definitely oat. Number three, the champagne of alternative dairy. That's almond. That's, that's, that's got that lovely sweet nuttiness. Number one just has to die. It's, I should have guessed the ones that I liked last. Okay, hold on. I'm a big girl. I can do this. Is it soy? It's soy. It's soy. Ugh. I'm sorry, you soy lovers are weird. I don't, I don't. No. The main thing that you want to do with rave gloves is just go up to people and like blow their minds. And then, oh God, then you get kind of lost and you want to blow your own. You kind of follow that around for a little while, so it's really fun. Anyway. <laughs> I don't know how to contour. I've never, I've never, it's never been my thing. Oh yeah, this nectarine needed me. I think you're supposed to put it like along the front part and then give yourself a jawline. And then I think probably you'd want a little bum chin. Blend it in, la 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 la. Make small talk. How was your day? Honestly, you look a little bruised. Like, don't get me wrong, you are gorgeous, but this is really bringing out your natural beauty. And then we add highlighter in here to really bring out the apple of your nectarineness. And, oh, how beautiful you are. Nice. Yes, nice, thank you. Um, this, I can't paint, I, so I just need you to know that up front, it's not the hot sauce's fault. Here we go. I have sort of a round face. Little nose situation there. I think I probably would be wearing a red lip. Delightful. I've decided that in my self portrait, I'm gonna have bangs. There we go. I have a, a you know what? We've got some freckles. Freckle. That probably wasn't a good call. And you know what? I am wearing sunglasses. Ugh. Oh dear, it's just getting worse. I'm gonna sign it. There we go. That's me, my self portrait in hot sauce. So this is a jade roller. I've never used it to flatten Play-Doh. However, I do have a three-year-old. And the best thing about Play-Doh is there are no mistakes. So even if you rip it, you just make something else, make a little snake. I'm gonna use this to make a family of snakes that owns an ice cream parlor together. This is the pink one. She's a little self-conscious because she's shorter than the green one, who I think is her cousin who's visiting, trying to learn the trade. This is grandma. She shrunk a little due to osteoporosis. She drank a lot of alternative dairy, a lot of soy. But you know, she's still kicking it. She does Pilates, so she stretches out. Look at her. 
I broke grandma. The osteoporosis is back. So there we go. Uh, there's a lot more drama, but we don't have time for it. So you'll have to tune in for chapter two of Ice Cream Snake Stories. Ha, 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 ha.